They told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. Why aren't we on the damn road? We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just... Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Why are we stopped? Idiot. So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. Come on, we're falling behind. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country, they lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles. Born and bred. Get back on the damn road. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn... I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now, it is time to prosper. <laughs>